we are always looking for products with increased bubble stability and increased start impact. Those are two things that in some of the markets that we serve are extremely important. So when Exxon came to us with the Exceed XP7 and said, hey, we think we can increase bubble stability immensely while also increasing your dart impact, we said, absolutely, let's try it out. Our vapor barrier products rely heavily on a dart drop test because that correlates to the puncture resistance that's out in the field. On the install, people are dropping rebar on top of the poly. Cement trucks come in and drive across the polyethylene. Rocks get dropped on it, tools get dropped on it. Puncture resistance is, is extremely important because one hole in that vapor barrier really negates the entire purpose of it being there, providing that barrier between the soils and the concrete. With the Exceed XP 7 Series, at first it was hard to believe the numbers that they were putting out there, but once we trialed it, we found it to be a very good product. Prior metallocenes that we ran when we first developed our vapor barrier product would normally pass two to three out of 10 drops on the dart drop that we do today. We and others were running products that we thought were the greatest and latest products out on the market. Those products were passing five to six times out of 10 on the dart drop. When ExxonMobil came to us with the XP7 series and we ran the trials and we put it on the dart drop, we were seeing eight to nine passes out of 10 on a very consistent basis. And when we put that product in, our bubble sits up and runs perfect. Which is the whole key to increasing your output. The more that we use the Exceed XP7, the more benefits that we can see in it. Three, six, nine months from now, it's gonna be infiltrated into products like uh, lawn and garden, mulch, other chemical packaging products. It was such an improvement over the prior products and prior formulas that we were amazed.